Hello everyone. Have you ever wonder why water is very important to life? In this video, you will learn about water properties and its importance. Water is a universal solvent. Water is able to dissolve variety substances especially hydrophilic substances. Hydrophilic substances are any polar molecules and ionic molecules, which has electrical charge. Hence dissolved in water. Such as salts, sugars, acids, alkalis and some gases especially oxygen and carbon dioxide. The partial charge of water molecules dissolve substances, by surrounding charged particles and pulling them apart. Hydrophobic substances are nonpolar molecules which has no electrical charge, hence does not dissolve in water. Such as fats and oil. Fats and oil has no net electrical charge. Therefore, it is not attracted to water molecules. Water is important to living organism because it dissolves many bodies solutes and it essential part of many metabolic processes within the body. For example, water is needed to hydrolyze ADP. Enzymatic reaction involves water to break down substance. Water has low viscosity, hence it moves fluidly or flows easily. This is due to the hydrogen bonds among water molecules break and reform. Therefore, there is less internal resistance to flow among water molecules. Hydrogen bonds among water molecules break and reform. Water's low viscosity is importance to life because, it allows movement of organelles within the cell or also known as cellular motion. It also allows blood to flow through narrow passages in blood circulatory system. Furthermore, it act as lubricant to reduce force of friction, between two objects or surfaces that are moving against each other. For example, synovial fluid at the knees. Water has high specific heat capacity. Specific heat capacity is the amount of energy required to change the temperature for one gram of a substance by one degree Celsius. Water has high specific heat capacity as a result of the extensive hydrogen bonding between its molecules. It requires a large amount of heat energy to break hydrogen bonds. To break the extensive hydrogen bonding between water molecules, water need to absorb large amount of heat energy without drastically rising its temperature. Water's high specific heat capacity importance in life are To maintain the Earth's climate the oceans buffer large fluctuation in temperature by absorbing large heat energy from the atmosphere. Furthermore, it enable organisms to regulate their body temperature more effectively. For example, during fever, water in the body will absorb the heat. Since water has high specific heat capacity, our body temperature will not drastically rise. Water has high latent heat of vaporization. Latent heat of vaporization is energy needed to turn liquid water into water vapor. Water has high latent heat of vaporization because high heat energy is needed to turn liquid water into water vapor. The hydrogen bonds between water molecules make it difficult for them to be separated and vaporized. High heat energy is absorbed by the hydrogen bonds before it breaks, and convert liquid into vapor. Water's high latent heat of vaporization importance in life. Allowing organism to cool down because the escaping water vapor will carry heat energy with them. For example, sweat from the skin and transpiration in green leaves. Sweat can regulate temperature and cool the body. Transpiration allow plant cells to cool down and prevents direct sunlight from damaging the delicate cells. Water has high surface tension. Surface tension is a measure of the strength of the water's surface film. Water has a very high surface tension. This is due to the strong cohesion and high adhesion properties because of its polar nature. Strong cohesion and high adhesion causing the water sticky and elastic, and tends to clump together into drops rather than spread in a thin film. In cohesion, hydrogen bond is formed between water molecules. In adhesion, hydrogen bond is formed between water molecules and other surface or object. 
Surface tension permits water to hold up substances heavier and denser than itself. For example, water strider able to walk on water, and needle floats on water. Water's high surface tension importance in life is for capillary action, which allows water to move through the plant's xylem, and through the blood vessels in our body. Water able to move as continuous column along xylem from roots to the leaves due to adhesion and cohesion. The last property of water is, water has maximum density at 4 degrees Celsius. As temperature decreases, water turns from liquid to solid or ice. In liquid form, hydrogen bonds break and reform between water molecules and as it turns to ice, Hydrogen bonds become more stable. Below 4 degrees Celsius, hydrogen bonds are very stable and expand, forcing water molecules further from each other and form air spaces between water molecules. This causes ice is less dense than water and floats on top of water. Water's maximum density at 4 degrees Celsius importance in life is. At freezing temperature, water will freeze on the top first creating a layer that insulates water below it and preventing it from freezing. This will allow aquatic organisms to survive, and live inside a partly frozen pond during winter. Ice floats at the top act as insulator, to maintain optimal temperature for aquatic organisms to survive. That's all for water molecules. In the next lesson, you will learn about carbohydrates molecule.